This event was developed to provide a creative outlet for the community's youth to highlight their artistic abilities. We're excited to present these artistic teens who will be inspiring us with their musical talents. It's a competition, yeah, but it's also a chance to share the thing that you love with everyone on Huntington Beach. I'm losing my mind, losing my mind, losing control. This fish is in the sea that's turning to me. Oh, 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 oh. Where the world takes for a beat of a drum. Oh, oh. If I could find a way to see the straight out of run away to some fortune that I, I should have found by now. I'm waiting on this. dance professionally when I get older and yeah maybe be a dance teacher one of those two I'm really not doing this for the prize. Like, I generally do love to sing. Friends, family, you guys did an amazing job. I don't know what you did, but keep doing it. The benefits of the arts are innumerable. They improve our daily lives, contribute to improved mental and physical health, encourage critical thinking, and ameliorate communication. And the best part is, the benefits of the arts are all embracing. receiving a guitar, a guitar center gift card. And the third runner up is Max Hernandez. <laughs> Jonathan had to leave for another performance tonight, so Yasmin Bravo will be taking his place. Second runner up will be receiving a $200 American Express gift card. Give that to me real quick. And the second runner up is Melinda Jack. Performing to be my forever. The runner up who will be receiving a $300 gift card is Jonathan Sai. Please come up, Yasmin. And as you all know, the winner of the first annual Surf City Showcase and a $500 American Express gift card is Maria Fuente, performing Hallelujah. How does it feel to win, Maria? This is a first, let me just tell y'all. <laughs> Thank you. Don't cry, please. You're going to make me cry. All right, let's give a final round of applause to all these talented performers. They worked so hard, not just tonight, but the last couple of months, to prepare themselves for this event.